I don't know. Also, we pretend to be a Siri Nova deck. So people try to go for a long round 3, and then my engine just wrecks them, right? Now we're playing tier 1. Is this... Is this even close to considerably tier 1? Okay, so this is gonna be tough, right? We have the Axeman matchup. And I can't clear, I only have one clear. So how do we get around that? I think we don't, right? Axeman, we just lose. Again, very risky hand. We didn't find Fog or the Zap, so now the, the Elven Merc could brick us. Which is very upsetting. Also, I only have one Mandrake. I guess I might have two with Ithlin, uh, Ithne, and then I can Mandrake like uh, Darren and one Axeman, but that's not going to be enough, right? Uh, if you don't have more than one clear, why don't you run a Tori? Uh, most of my silvers are spells, which enable the growing of the Dolbethana sentries. Like, because I, I can't really do the Zap thing, I can't really do the, the Sage thing, it doesn't fit in the deck. Do I go toe-to-toe -to -toe and go to round 3 instantly? That's probably a bad idea. Two zaps and two magic are enough for a round? You think so? Going to commit a wetter in round two. Yeah, but then you will always hero pass me, right? If I draw a fog here, I'm super screwed. Okay. What is the most expendable? It's the Dragoon, right? Dragoon first. Them to a man. Oh shit, thanks Fra. 500 bits? I wish the lady would go party, 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 party. That would be better. But thanks very much, man. I really appreciate that. Happy partner day? Yeah, 4th of June is, uh, is my partner birthday. I'll remember that. Don't you, don't you worry. <clears throat> One round is a bad idea. Is it? It depends on how many Axemen he has access to. If he is, uh, and he may spare Maidens, then he wins, for sure. I need to protect this, right? I also need to bait the Skellige Storm. I play this to the right, I think. This moment, I've seen it already. Stormy. Do it. Do you use Ratbot? You have my respect. What's a Ratbot? Random question. Do you believe in love? Define love. I think he has a better long round, but we'll see. I mean, it's almost guaranteed, right? I just need to bait out the Skellige Storm, that's all I have to do. I foresee victory for you. Do I mandrake this? Like, I'm assuming we're gonna mandrake twice, right? I think I mandrake this. 
He can't spare mate in it, he can't res it. He might end up being bricked. But then again, do I have to leave it there so he'll commit Skelliger Storm? The sooner he commits Skelliger Storm, the better, right? So I wait I wait with the magic. I don't commit it yet. I think that's correct. Zap the Axeman? Zap? I, I can't. It's my only clear. Like, this is my only fog and this is my only clear. I, I can't commit a zap. <laughs> Why do you not commit Skelliger Storm already? Do it! Why doesn't he do it? I don't want to fog these because I'm gonna mandrake them. Everything all right. Oh we get punished. It has to be the zap here then. But what if it isn't the zap? No, it has to be zap. Let him res. I mean, you're way better off just manjaking Darren. So there we go. Okay, so do I... Do I leave this to take one more turn so I get an extra heal? Answer is no, definitely not, right? What if he has the second Skelliger Storm? That would suck. I don't know, do I wait one more turn clearing this? I wait one more turn clearing this, right? Just clear twice with Ice Knight? That doesn't work. Her clear doesn't go to the graveyard, I'm pretty sure. Nigh is the time of the white frost and white light. Mandrake, clear next turn. You need row space. What do you need? I'm trying to fill up the row so he can't, so he can't uh, thingy me, he can't harpooner me. But that's never gonna happen, right? So it's Mandrake now. No, it's clear now. We clear now. Do I wait one more turn with the clear? I mean, I have two Mandrakes, right? How long can I? How long can I wait here? So it's like this, into this, into this, into this, into this, into this, into this, fuck. That's upsetting. So then we kill Sigurdrifa, like this. Can I do this? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. He'll have to start committing Axemen now, right? Combo Breaker? Yeah, that's the thing. Not getting the Ancient Foglet off of Black Blood is real disappointing. We were hoping for uh, Ancient uh, Ancient Foglet. Okay, so this is this is a turn. Now I clear. This is the turn. And I clear here, so if he wants to harpoon her again... He'll always harpoon her here, though.
So I'll, I'll put this... Do I try to fill in my row? I can never fill that up anyway, right? 3, 6... I can with Ithne. Fuck it, I'll try. The time of the white frost and white Clear. light is nigh. Got a bunch of nice healing in, that's why I waited so long. And now my last weapons are Mandrakes. Is that enough? So yeah, so we just cleared with the uh, Ida, but we don't have a clear in graveyard, so I can't I can't uh, Ithne clear. Yeah, and this is this is why I wanted to fill up the row, and I'm not going to be on time to do it. I have to try and fill it up. I have I have seven here now. I need only two more units. The Ida will do it. This dies to Harpooner too. He only has one more Harpooner, right? I'm gonna pretend I don't have a Mandrake. I want him to commit his Axeman too late. I honestly think it's this. But the big one, so it I survives. Am! I guess we needed to last raid. The last raid would suck. He would have last raid, right? Like I'm already committed. I'm trying to play around Harpooners more than around last raid. If this dies, my engine stops. I kind of need this to survive, right? So do I have to mandrake this? God, this sucks. Also, my Renew is dead. God, this sucks. Then again, Ida or Ithlin wouldn't even hit anything because I, I bricked the first Merc. I think we just lost. Like, he always kills this, right? I also still think I'm supposed to magic this first in case he has Spare Maidens. Yeah, magic the Axeman. I should have done that first. So this is why he kills my Dragoon. And then I could... Yeah, there's the axe. Shit, I could have prevented that. I could have played around that. God dang it. Can I trust him to not... I think I lost on the, the magic. That was the wrong order. Idiot. Do I play into last raid even more? He also has one more Harpooner, right? Humans have no place in Broccolon. I'm so mad at myself. I could have stopped this. I could have bricked this spare maiden. What if he doesn't have another Axeman in hand? I would have won, right? Okay, so I did play around this, but now the thing here is, if I play this out, my Dragoon stops hitting a, a target to boost and these stop growing as well. So what is more points here? Playing an 18, I would need 6 turns for that to get full value? I always play this, always. Okay, so now he needs to catch 60 points, 60, 68? 60... 68. Can he do it? How do you catch 30 more? You can't do that, right? 
Last raid? No last raid? He didn't do it. Fucking three and zero. Third win in a row. Who would have thought? Guys, Squirt of Fog. You guys have been sleeping on Squirt of Fog for all this time. He could have done it with Last Raid or Sihil? Last Raid would have damaged for 21 and the Axeman would grow by 9. So that would be a 30 point play. That still wouldn't have been enough. Uh, why didn't you fog the melee? Mandrake is irrelevant. I didn't fog melee because I was... Earlier on I was planning to Mandrake the Axeman and the Darren, right? I didn't want Fog to take on the Axeman because I was going to Mandrake it, but now in hindsight that would have been better. I mean it's better to hit nothing, it's better than to hit nothing to just hit an Axeman. Now you're probably right, I'll do that next time. Uh, Alter Falter, 007, thank you very much for the sub man, really appreciate it. You overthink it man? It also wasn't the Fog, it was the double Mandrake. I prefer to overthink and to underthink. Margold Hailstorm would have done it. Don't change it till we lose, right? I'm not changing it until I lose. 